gotta make sure y'all see these dates because the only reason I'm making this video right now so late is because I like the nighttime view. It's way better and it's just better for content. So whatever you want, your world is yours. This message is gonna be brief because I gotta get my ass to sleep and make sure that this shit gets uploaded at least before I get to the gym. But, you know, focus on the fact that behind all of everything that I've ever done is the fact that I stick to the integrity of the principles and doing the work. In a world full of people who lean on superior explanation, you know, they, they talk a lot, they claim to know a lot, but they aren't a lot. Know that at the core of everything is me waking up, is me posting a 444 post, irrespective if I fucking feel like it or not. All of it irrespective if I feel like it or not. Me getting to the gym exactly the fuck on time. It's not like I give a fuck not to. It's just like, hey, this is what we do. What else? Me making these books, me living my life, me being a person that I'm meant to be. It gets really annoying to live in a world full of people who claim to know all this quote unquote spiritual shit, but I'm realizing the whole entire spiritual community needs cleaning up. There's so many people that lack basic integrity and basic conceptions of existence to the point where you realize most of these motherfuckers is just rejects and delusional people in society who have found a way to articulate and rationalize their incompetence by finding some type of language that makes them not accountable to the physical world, you know, and this is the thing about spirituality. It's meant to give you a higher level of awareness so that you can operate at a higher level. I always bring the crystals up because people always have these leanings. They lean towards these things. And it's like, you don't realize that you're seeking to make yourself more effective. So when I see people lean on these crystals and shit, but they're still broke, they're still out of shape. They're still basically delusional because they're reaching for crystals, trying to be more effective and creating earthly effects. Everybody doesn't realize that spirituality is a means of creating heightened experiences on earth, heightened earthly effects. And to everybody out there who's claiming to be spiritual, but who sucks at earth, you make yourself look extra stupid by sucking at earth. First of all, being sober, being physically fit, these are the basic functions of any organism. You go outside and any organism, a pigeon, a fucking lizard, anything, a fucking tree, is sober and as fit as possible. Humans are the only self-debilitating creatures that we've ever seen, and they do it with brazen arrogance. It's ridiculous. Enlightened and rich are higher faculties of the human mind, like I explained in two videos ago, where we know that money is an extension of the mind. If the mind didn't exist, money wouldn't exist. And enlightenment is truly arriving at truth. This journey to truth, like I just posted in the video where I shared me teaching people, leading people, before this coaching thing became a quote, quote unquote industry, a lot of people came in the game because you could monetize it. But I've been doing this shit. I just found an actual way to make a living off of what I was already being. You know, you look at everything and it's just like, so many people are just weirdos. Whatever you want, your world is yours. Consider the vibrations raised. Man, it's been a long ass motherfucking day. But the bottom line is this, a lot of people are trying and a lot of people are not getting the earthly effects that they want. Sober, fit, enlightened, and rich. This journey to truth is a journey for its own sake. There's no reward for truth except for finding and establishing the truth so that you can actually live an enlightened existence, an enhanced existence. I didn't seek the truth because it would give me some power over earth, like everybody who looked for the fountain of youth back in the day, looking for immortality and all this other weird shit. I needed the truth because I was tired of living in a world of lies. 
being born with this skin color, being, yo, bro, a lot of people have no clue to the degree of which society programs different types of people to believe false consciousness about themselves and thus rendering them disconnected from actuality. So I needed the truth because I lived in a world full of bullshit and I was willing to risk my entire mind. Like to find the truth, you need to be able to risk your fucking mind. These people are not looking for the truth. They're looking for confirmation and advice. So bottom line is this, I want y'all to know that mental effectiveness, the name of the game is being mentally effective. When I say people are mentally inferior, it's because they can't put their mind to shit to make shit happen. And in a world full of people who put their mind to the same exact thing, staying sober, simple. It's like, why do we even have to talk about this shit? Sober, fit, enlightened, and rich, just being a fucking, a fucking being, just being, right? This is just being. Everything else follows. Personality, hobby, all this other shit. All that shit follows. But just being, well-being. All these people suck at earth. And it's about being effective. And once you recognize that the spiritual community needs wild cleaning up because all these people are delusional as fuck. And when you realize they're delusional as fuck because their minds are ineffective and everybody's trying to become more effective at producing earthly conditions, whether or not they're trying to admit it or not, either that or they're running away from ever trying to make any impact in earthly conditions because they just given up and realize how the incompetent they are, how incompetent they are and how much of just social rejects they are. You know, so, you know, the spiritual community is full of social rejects full of motherfucking weirdos and incompetent fools. But every so often you have a motherfucker like me up here. It's happened all throughout human history who just is it, bro. A lot of people try to be something. A lot of people got these gimmicks. A lot of people want to mimic shit. Some people just is it, you feel me? Whatever you are, your world is yours. Consider the vibrations raised, keeping this shit short. Gotta get this shit uploaded. Gotta get some sleep. Whatever you are, your world is yours. I love all of you. Learn to recognize the necessity of becoming mentally effective because that's what intrinsically everybody is trying to do to produce better earthly results. And people who are spiritual are fucking bullshitters for the most part. This whole world needs cleaning up because everybody's incongruous and everybody sucks at earth for the most part. Very rare people like myself don't. And the point is to join my team, to join my school, to join the program so you can learn to not suck at earth, so you can hear these types of thoughts, think correctly, produce the results that you want on earth and create the experience that you're intended to create. Let's not create any type of unnecessary reasoning as to why we should be what we should be. It's just what's supposed to be. Why do you need a reward to be the best and experience the best life possible other than the experience and being the best life possible. The truth is its own reward for its own sake. Sobriety is its own reward for its own sake. You don't need to get a reward for being, what do I get for being sober? Like, what? What do I get for being fit? What? What do I get for being enlightened and not being delusional and ignorant? What? What do I get for, what? The joy of living, bro. Why do you, why are you Consider the vibrations raised. I love y'all. We just focus on being mentally effective. Consider the vibrations raised.